how do stomata help to taste food stomata in the leaves of plants are situated in the position at the tip point that is at the tip corner with a small opening which helps the plant to absorb carbon dioxide they also exhale oxygen out from leaves this is the food for leaves which is done through stomata in plants and also water and other necessities of plants are absorbed through the stomata of leaves as with the plant variation stomata sizes do change and their working also changes but the feeding characteristics not change another place where the stomata of the plant come into contact with the outside surrounding of the environment is when sugar is combined with the stem of the root in the plant for making the glucose out of it there also all the leaves share their sugar through the small openings at the tip of the stomata hence stomata help in two main ways for the plant How is tumor formed? Tumor is nothing but a body portion swelling extraordinary in the place like neck, brain and other parts of the body. They are of two types, internal and external. External tumor is formed due to the cell reproduction again and again without any much notable time and quick enough to be noticed after becoming big. Internal tumor on the other hand forms inside due to excessive stress and tension building on the brain this is formed due to the clot of the blood flowing in the brain or in some other portion of the body parts this may lead to a paralytic part of some body parts they both can be cured from operation and external cases involve the removal of the excessive mass of the body which is not that easy because blood loses too much in case of internal operation it is not that easy to do because there are some problems that can occur during an operation how do dogs learn to swim dogs are born with strong natural instincts including barking digging and being totally lovable to humans some people also think that swimming is a skill that all dogs naturally have why would they call it the doggy paddle unless it was something all canines could do but swimming isn't necessarily an innate ability for dogs believe it or not some dogs are uncomfortable in the water just because they paddle doesn't mean they can stay afloat it's true that some pooches such as water spaniels and retrievers are natural swimmers in fact many are born knowing how to swim it's their instinct but others have to be taught and still others simply can't swim well for example dogs with heavy chests such as bulldogs sink in the water some dogs learn to swim by being rewarded with praise as they become more comfortable in the water or by playing games such as fetch which helps introduce them to deep water little by little what is a mummy a mummy is a preserved body that has been prepared for thousands of years the ancient egyptians believed that their bodies had to be preserved as they were in life and that the dead lived on in the next world they also thought that the person would use the body in the next world so they spent much effort into developing methods of embalming the process was simple when mummifying started and gradually became more elaborate ancient texts say that the whole and complete treatment took 70 days embalmers removed the person's brain through their nostrils using a hook the way a surgeon does they removed the internal organs except for the heart and the kidney and they filled the empty abdomen with linen pads or sawdust the coffins which the mummies were laid in were made of either stone or wood they were shaped like the body or rectangular with the mummy inside of it the coffin would be placed in the tomb with many objects they used in life the egyptians believed that the person would need objects they used in everyday life with them to go to the next world thanks for watching do like share subscribe to sahil book house